Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Ness Porter down here at Mattapan Square. I want to show you how T-Mobile operates. <laughs> they don't operate too good, but let's get an idea of what's going on. 1667 Blue Hill Ave. So you come inside the store, right? You got a store. You have a line of people. But the problem is nobody knows who's next. So they got to figure it all out. No, no structure. How long? How long you, you been? How long you been waiting? A long time. Ten minutes. Okay, ten minutes is not too bad. So it's like she she jumped out of queue. So she's she's out. Yeah. So, so he's next after her. Then then you then. Okay, after him. See, they, they, they don't give you a number. How do they... They just tell you you're next, and you just have to assume you're next. At least the one in South Bay takes your name down and calls you. This one doesn't do that for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe I actually manage that question. Only got three workers working, so... We'll see. Sit down here and just watch and observe what's going on. You guys stay right there. Which one? The one in the back? Oh, he did. He didn't move from that spot yet. Not, not even once. So what is he doing? Just, just chilling. What is he doing? Is he working? He's, but he's not helping the customer. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Maybe he's got something more important to do back there. Maybe. Tell the guy that's way over there. Let's see what he's doing. Huh. I don't know what he's doing either. Probably be there. We'll see how long he stays there.
What you do, you go to your that's in your settings. So go to YouTube and, and and find out how to keep your phone from interrupting. It it'll tell you. It's it's in your settings. Cause you, what you do is you're watching a video and it's in this, interrupting the video. So find out how to shut that off. Cause that's 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 interrupting. There's a way to do that though. It's in your settings. You got an Android phone, right? Yeah. Just just, just go to your settings and it's. it's there's going to be some prompt to tell you how to shut that off. If you have any problems, just go on YouTube and ask how to keep my phone from Google interrupting my uh, my videos or movies. Uh-huh. Right. Uh huh. Does so it cut you? Does it cut the video off completely? Yeah, yeah that's in your settings. Yeah, you, you you can you you can you can actually shut that off though. You should you should go, you should go to your apps and shut that app off. Shut that Google app off. Now you mean it cut it off? Cut it off? Well, no, it'd just be in. It would still be in your phone, but it'd be inactive. Well, it's, it's on your settings. Like, I don't know how to go through those prompts on your, on your particular phone. It's but not on the phone. It's on my tablet. This is happening. The same thing. It's go, go through your settings on your tablet and, and find that one that shuts that one off. Or if you can't find it, just go on YouTube. There's so much stuff on YouTube now. It tells you how to do it. It's, it's going to give you a tutorial on how to step by step how to shut that off. And I know what you're talking about because it interrupts what you're watching and just like kick you right off for it. Right. Yeah, you should get it. So it's basically like an advertisement coming up. Yeah. But you you, you should get shut that off. It is definitely. Yeah. But you definitely should shut that off in your settings, so. though. I know, I know, like on my phone, I could go to the apps and say force, like force stop, so I, I stop it. Yeah. If it keeps popping back up again, you could just kind of shut it off so it's not active. Yeah. But it's still be there. You just have to activate it if you ever need it. Yeah. <laughs> but when all else fails, go on YouTube. YouTube will tell you how to do it. Yeah, thank you. Yes. I'm surprised they couldn't help you with that. They should help you with that. Yeah, definitely. Oh, he's he's that called the customer service. Mm -hmm. Customer service, they they got like um, an they got an agent that like, they'll troubleshoot you and run you through the whole scenario mm -hmm. and how to do that. Yeah. Right, yeah, 
Take care. Be safe out there. The line did get a little smaller. Get that gentleman in there. So he's he's the last one in line. Actually, no, he's. Did they take care of you yet? They didn't take care of you. Yeah. Yeah, you're all set. No, no, they don't take. They take care. They take. Oh, okay. So, so he, so he's. You're after him. Gotcha. Uh huh. Right. That's the same thing. Right. This, you might as well wait here. If you, if you here, you might as well just wait. Yeah. So I just need a, um, a SIM card. Oh yeah, that, yeah, SIM card. That's what I need. I need a SIM card too. And well, I, need, I, I think I have one. I just gotta get another one. Because uh, uh, what they did is, um, if, if you have Sprint, if you didn't switch over with your no, SIM no, card. No, 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 I have T-Mobile, but they give me, I have a set of something, I reset my phone. So they're gonna send me a text message to confirmation, uh -huh. so I can receive the text message. When I'm trying to take the SIM out to put another SIM card, that's a seven. They don't come to SIM card, they don't take the SIM card. So I won't need an extra SIM card. To put another phone and then to send the text message and then put it on the, the phone and then wow it sounds complicated <laughs> yeah it's complicated but i was so you gotta you take a sim card and put it in one phone to get the text message yeah they they're put... gonna send me because i'm recent i am reset my phone uh-huh so they send me a text message to configuration and then now i can't receive the text message because the phone is not working oh i see so i just I hear you. Let's take like a walk around while I'm waiting, right? See, see what they got on display here. Yeah, you too. I don't know if I even got you on there. I don't even know if I even got you on. I didn't. Yeah, I think you, did. you think so? Well, you let me know if you see it. Yeah. Would you have to say edit it? <laughs> I could. Well, if you could find, if you could find it, then let me know. I won't, I won't give you a hard time. I won't purposely put you on there. I just don't get into the propaganda. Oh, okay, I got you. I said I seen you somewhere before. I don't know where I know you from. I seen you before somewhere. It, it'll come to it'll come to my later on. I I know I seen you somewhere before. I just can't place it right now. You got a very familiar face. Motorola. Mm, not necessarily, no. But I know I, I ran into you before. I don't know where at, though, but I've definitely seen you before. It might have been at one of my many events I go to. Huh? Might be at one of those many events that I go to. Uh, which one? I go to a lot of, like, like marches and protests and stuff like that. No. No, you probably didn't see me. You work in the What about... Then, uh... Then, uh... 
next to the next to next to the uh, fire station. That is that is station. Might have seen me there, yeah. They had a they had an event over there a couple of months back. Uh, some youth program up on that. You might have seen me there. Yeah. I see you. Um, uh, you were. You were seeing you. You seeing the under. Um, um, twenty eight seventy five. Washington. <laughs> yeah, you saw me there. Yeah, yeah. You definitely saw me there. I, 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 yeah, I, I definitely see that. How do you? You got that number right? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, he got the address. He know. He, he know. <laughs> he said it. He said it. Where is <laughs> now he got it right though too. Nah, but he now he's absolutely wanted to say. Wait a minute. That's where I know you from. He's working there. Oh, okay. See, I see a lot of people. I, I sometimes I can't remember all the faces I see, man. That's true. Yeah, I'm not waiting. 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 I'm
So what happened was, um, if you had Sprint and you didn't pay attention to the text messages that they um, were sending you to switch your uh, SIM card over to T-Mobile, May 1st was the, the last day for you to do that. And by you not doing that, they just shut your service off. Whether you paid your service or not, that didn't matter. They just, just cut you off. So now you need to get a new SIM card so that you can... Uh, reuse your phone so I'm down here just waiting for a sim card so I can utilize my I think another gentleman a couple other people doing the same thing too so I'm just killing some time while I'm waiting see something you like check it out Not too sure what the AO3S is, but it's a phone. That'd be a lower. The A series is like the lower budget of the S series. Like, but they both do this. You know, it's the same thing. Depends on what you're looking for. Mm. No, you want the one with the clip? It's, it's, it's small? Um, yeah. These are all Apple products. If you like Apple, I'm not a big Apple person. I tried Apple out a couple of times. It wasn't easy to navigate as much as the uh, Android. Uh, Android has a much better navigation system and easy to use. I'm not saying Apple can't be learned and navigated, but just didn't work out for me. I tried it, it didn't work, especially with doing stuff that I do. Hey guys, we're gonna hang around for another 20 minutes and see what happens. S22, six, actually the prices came down. I remember when the S22 was like $1,200. It's down a little lower now. The S23 is like a thousand bucks plus taxes, I guess. Samsung Galaxy Z flip four five G. Hmm. Alright guys, we'll hang around a little bit longer and see what what's going on. Yes, so we will ship it to you. Yes. Uh, today I'm going to send you that I'm going to buy all of these. 